Hey guys, All Electrical here. This is just a quick video to explain two-way switching and how it works. This example here is looped at the switch. If you have no idea what that is, please refer to my other video that differentiates the difference between looped at the light and looped at the switch. So watch that first before watching this. So in regards to how this all works, I'll explain it now, starting with the active. So this is, your, this is your switchboard here and your circuit breakers and stuff like that. It'll come out of your circuit breakers and it'll loop at your first switch here, right? And then it just loops to your next switch, your power, and that just goes into a connector there. You don't need a hard active there and it'll go to your next switch in the circuit there. So if you look at the switch inside of things, because this is just your hard active that just loops from switch to switch to switch, throughout your house, this part here. So this part is just for your switching. So you get your hard active coming in to your common. You follow this solid line up, that's your switch. That's your, that just means your switch is on. The power will flow through here to your number one. And because this switch is also on, it'll flow down here and then up to your light, okay? So with this switch, if you flicked it off, that means this bar will move and disappear and it'll become this dotted line. So it'll be switching between the common and the two, right? So if you come back over to here to this switch, walk over the other side of the house and this switch, and you turn that off, the power will flow through here, down the dotted line here, across, and because this switch is also off, it'll flow up the dotted line to the light. So no matter what you do at what switch, if this is off, you can turn it off and on from here, you can turn it off and on from here, doesn't matter and then your return path for the power from the light is just your neutral, which is here, all right? And then your earth just goes through and loops at your switches here and here. These are just connectors and it goes up to your light and also continues on to your next switch. Uh, your neutral is exactly the same here. Loops at this switch, loops at this switch, up to the light here, because normally the cable that comes from your switch to your light, your neutral would also come from there too. In the same in the same position here. So you wouldn't take a neutral from here to here or here to here. I mean you can, but it just gets confusing for the next person that tries to touch your wiring. But generally you just have to have a twin and earth, one mil or one point five mil. I'll explain that in my last video as well. The difference between looping at the light and the switch. So I'll go into a little bit, bit of detail about that. But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, this looping terminal here isn't used because obviously, like I just said, we're looping at the switch, not the light. 